Hey everyone, welcome to the Horror Show. I'm Cecil Laird. I'm Brittany Lee. Dark Heron. Back with another trailer reaction for you guys. This is for the brand new trailer for the upcoming Will Smith Netflix film. That's right, he made a deal with Netflix just <laughs> like Adam Sandler did, except it was just for one movie, and it's apparently the most expensive movie that Netflix has ever made, if I'm not mistaken. Uh, so this, to this one. Date, to this date, yeah, exactly. <laughs> uh, this one is called Bright. And it's, uh, I don't, you know, if you don't know what it is, maybe I just won't ruin it and we can just experience it together. How's that? All right. All right. So, uh, do you know what it is? No. All right. Well, perfect. Then here we go. In three, two, one, go. Different doesn't mean anybody's better or worse than anybody. Hey, uh, where's the diversity hat? I got a dude in my car. I didn't ask for it, but the whole world is watching. Yeah, watch out, not in this car. Yeah. Boy, it's okay if you don't like me. Man, I'm not out here to be your friend. I need to know if shit pop off that you got my back. Can't hide it, boy. Humans have physical talent. Like the face. What's my face? The human needs a lot more conjugal love type face. Do not wink at me like that. <laughs> 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 oh, David Ayer did this? Of course, it's two cops. Wicked. crazy like that's that's a good enough movie to make it to the theaters and oh it absolutely gonna be, is yeah, it's yeah, gonna it be <laughs> well, but, but, but what big studio would go for something like that yeah, yeah. Exactly. like no, exactly. that's that's i love that i love yeah. that and it has all the david ayer sensibilities oh yeah definitely um but you know because it's a street level crime thing except what would happen if these street level cops uh found a magic wand right. that you know a bunch of bad uh, magical people were after you know that's that's really fucking cool yeah. <laughs> um Britt, what did you think i think it's awesome it looks so i, I all the different um uh, creatures <clears throat> the two sorry all the different creatures that they have the the uh, the what at least the pixies these guys and then there was at least one more that guy looked like like so an, these, elf? Guys, yeah, yeah, an elf yeah it looks like yeah. it looked like fairy and these looks like orcs yeah. yeah 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 kind of like yeah so, and uh, yeah, and okay, there's and like the a, 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 a obviously a clash of coexisting. So. Yeah, there's. It looks like there's a class system almost, there, yeah, a, a, a hierarchy. Yeah. Um, yeah. If you're a pixie, get the 
fuck now. <laughs> yeah, well, they're just pests. Obviously. Yeah, obviously. Yeah. 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 Um, but uh, but the orcs look like the working class, which makes sense. Like it's really it's putting a lot of stuff on the nose, you know. Like the orcs are the are the working class, you know, blue collar grunts, and the elves are the high society, white collar. And it's like um, this is the first orc to become a cop. Yeah, so. yeah, it looks like that, doesn't it? Yeah. yeah. There, was it? Because I thought there was a couple. In... Well, I think there was oh, one no, scene it, where he, no. he, like an orc sees him it, like as a cop, and then. Like, oh, but that of, wasn't another cop. That was, that was no. Was that like orc a is a, is a criminal or something. Yeah, or, something or, like or that. at least just a normal one. Yeah. See, I'm profiling. I'm orc <laughs> profiling. <laughs> I don't know. I'm excited actually. Uh, when you first said, "Oh, it's a Will Smith movie. That's a Netflix movie," I was like. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Sure. Well, you have, but I didn't mention the no, fantasy thing. No, you too. didn't mention anything. You said Will Smith Netflix movie, mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. and I was like, okay. I yeah. Guess. But knowing but, that you're into fantasy, what do you think? No, it's awesome because it's it's a fantasy action movie. Mm-hmm. Yeah. That. <laughs> <laughs> You're all. I mean, you're you're as big into Harry Potter as I am, if not more so. Probably a little more so, actually. Probably. Uh, but uh, isn't that cool? Like the 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 wand, <laughs> like the magic wand sort of aspect. I don't know. That just is yeah, really cool to I, me. I am I am intrigued of their uh, concept of a magic wand and how it plays out. Because you know, I also watch Once Upon a Time too. So mm-hmm. they have magic wands, and those are different from obviously this one. Mm-hmm. This one seems volatile <laughs> we'll can grant you any kind of wish that you, that yeah you want. yeah that's yeah. cool uh it's a different way to approach it it's more like a magic lamp yeah, than, a, than yeah. a wand kind there's of there's one but. thing that we always know from any story it's that magic always comes at a price yeah that's true <laughs> always there's a price to pay so when you make your wish be careful what you say true true um uh dirk what do you think of the effects I think they look really good. It's pretty state of the art. Uh, it looked like that. It looks like that little fairy is there and he's fighting it. You know, he squishes the poor thing. I love that line though. He's like, "Oh, y'all go back to doing your gang activity. I'm just here trying to sell my house." <laughs> I, love, I love that. Yeah. Yeah, he's got the elf ears. He's definitely an elf. Um, uh, yeah, man, I, I'm. I'm really. Uh, I think the the makeup effect. Like that's the thing. It looks like they're gonna lean on all the things that fantasy movies do as well as you know street level crime movies it's just yeah. such a weird it's, it's, but interesting pairing yeah you know well that's max landis for you to, to... oh that's right <laughs> that's right you mentioned that and we actually just recorded a review recently for max landis's uh, comic book series called uh, green valley which ran for nine issues which we loved we thought yeah. it was a oh, fantastic so... blending of of old timey Viking uh, or old timey knights, yeah. and futuristic time travel technology, <laughs> and so now yeah. we've got street level cops mixed with fantasy <laughs> stuff. That's man, the dude is out there, but he is firing awesome. on all cylinders. Yeah, he is. You got to read Green Valley, by the yeah. way. You'd okay, love it. It was, a, it was actually nominated for an Eisner. Eisner. And Eisner is, and the Eisners are like the Oscars of comic books. Yeah. Uh, every year that's crazy it's so good Ike Barinholtz to do with the mustache is a funny comedian mm-hmm. um, I, I like him he was most recently in Suicide Squad uh, as the uh, as the well you haven't seen it I don't think but he was the uh, the guard yeah the prison the prison guard the prison guard yeah but uh, but yeah this looks awesome getting back to a good movie uh, I don't know what the deal is with the lady with the white eyes she looks like she's probably an elf also yeah like maybe there's different uh, like races of elves, like, yeah, like dark elves, albino elves. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> she looks like she'd be that, but she th- that one is moving a little bit. Like uh, uh, it's hard not to imagine Kate Beckinsale in Underworld with all of yeah. these action ladies doing all this cool like flipping and grabbing and all this stuff. But but nonetheless, I mean, the fact that we had this much to say about it is, I think, bodes well for it. <laughs> and again, David Ayer, what, what, what was the one that he did with Jake Gyllenhaal and um, the dude from Ant-Man? Uh, uh, End of Watch? End of Watch, yeah. Love that one. Yeah, that one was great. That was Love a great that cop one. movie. God, that was so good. Uh, and that was Training Day, too, right? He did Training Day also. No. No? What was no. the other one he did? He did Fury. Fury. With uh, Brad Pitt. Okay. The Tank. The Tank movie. Hmm. Okay. And I think he also did Brothers. Okay. And then End of Watch. 
Um, or, and Suicide Squad. And Suicide Squad. Okay, so. cool. All right. Well, there you go, guys. Uh, let us know in the comments down below if you're excited about Bright. Or if this this is definitely much better than the teaser that we got a little while ago. Mm -hmm. This is a full-on trailer, and yeah. this shows exactly what I was hoping for, <laughs> even though I didn't know I was hoping for it. <laughs> well, it was something I had just seen. You know that scene where they're pulling the wand out? Somebody's pulling the wand out of their wrist right now. Yeah, 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 out of the wrist, yeah. not out of a hole. No, 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 yeah. yeah, it's out of their wrist. That's, like, really cool. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Like, they've been hiding it. Yeah. Yeah. Smuggling in flesh. It. Smuggling it. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so like I said, let us know in the comments down below what you guys thought of this. Again, I know it's not really a horror, but I didn't know that exactly going into it, and there's obviously going to be some horrific aspects, judging by the um, burns and still piping hot bodies in the in the hallway that we saw, if that's indeed what they were. There was some crazy violence in it, too. Yeah, yeah, yeah definitely. Yeah. So, so. Um, I don't care. I'm glad we did this. So. <laughs> Thanks very much for watching. I've been Cecil Laird. I'm Brittany Lee. Dirk Heron. And remember, stay, stay scared. scared.